IBM is announcing the microprocessor chip for the Z196 computer. It's the fastest microprocessor in the industry at 5.2 gigahertz, and it's a significant step forward for mainframe computing. Financial institutions are doing many more transactions, but they also want to do more processing on those, whether it's checking for fraud or whether it's offering additional services to their customers and linking those together. That's driving more and more compute power around all of those transactions. It's been increasingly important uh, to have a system that's capable of, uh, of doing compute intensive work if we want to extend those kinds of applications uh, with, with uh, the capability to do more real-time analytics and, and introduce more intelligence right into the systems and making, making our software smarter. Uh, and and uh, as a result of that, it, it's very important to make sure that you have good performance. And if you can do the right transactions and the right analysis and studying of that data, you can use that to increase your business velocity, where you, you can study that data and make predictive decisions based on that data to allow you to do smarter health care or smarter banking or move your inventory around the world to, to better meet customer needs. It, it really just is a massive wealth of information out there that you're going to need high performance enterprise computing systems to analyze and make decisions. For example, we've added over a hundred new instructions into our microprocessor to help with certain types of performance and, and we've done that based on customer feedback from previous generations.